Hello there. There's a big whopping Saturday night at the cabin. So, um, let's just get started. I want to do a few videos. <laughs> The factor you make your kisser look good. Go out and try your luck, you may be done. Who read for Hollywood? Yeah, okay, we're gonna talk about Hollywood for a little bit and some stars of Hollywood. Uh, some of you just possibly might not, not even let me rephrase that, might not even know who we're talking about. Good. You got to go back a few years for this. I'm going to tell you some interesting stuff. I want to start with Spencer Tracy. Spencer Tracy and Catherine Hepburn were married. And one of the, well, the last film that, that Spencer Tracy did was one of his most famous, and that was Guess Who's Coming to Dinner with Sidney Poitier as a co-star and Catherine Hepburn also in it. And what a lot of people don't know is that the Spencer Tracy passed away less than one month after production wrapped up on that final film, um, and uh, and that was in 1967. Um, he um, had been ailing for a long time from it says poor health, uh, um, a lifetime of different excesses. The studio could not insure him. And to get the film made, because they were afraid he died during filming, um, they had their co-stars, Catherine Hepburn and the director, Stanley Kramer, put their salaries in escrow so that if Tracy did die during the filming, um, it would cover the cost of another actor to replace him. Um, and uh, he was only able to film limited hours of a day, and, and his wife, Catherine Hepburn, monitored his health. Um, and Sidney Poitier once said, uh, you know, it, his illness dominated everything. Um, we didn't know whether he'd finish the film, uh, if Tracy would be able to finish it, but he did. And about half hour later, he died. And we could probably just make this a short one and, and play a little bit of it's Hollywood and quit. Oh, 